Biel, a bilingual city in the heart of Switzerland, world-renowned as a watch metropolis. Many of the major brands are headquartered here. The art of watchmaking has a long tradition in Biel and is still practiced today. Many smaller manufacturers produce specialities which have a worldwide following. One such company is Glycine. Glycine stands for a combination of traditional and modern. The classic art of watchmaking and modern design, which stands out through the large diameter cases. The history of glycine, however, is marked by miniature works of the finest construction. In 1913, Eugène Melon began to construct small caliber watches with the Biele manufacturer, and he was very successful at this. He developed one of the first self-winding watches ever, and with it, revolutionized the watch industry. The Eugène Melon Automatic, a replica of the legendary Glycine watch made in 1931, reminds us of this great visionary today. The Bien 1914, a member of the classic line, reminds us of the year of the company's founding. This is now also produced as a replica. A new era in the company's history began in 1984, when Hans Brechbühler took over Glycine. With a tremendous personal effort, Brechbühler was able to establish the brand once again in the hard-fought watch market. The design of many models brings back memories of the rich and varied history of Glycine. An example of this is the Altus chronograph. Das Bauen von Uhren ist eine Leidenschaft, die ich mein ganzes Leben nicht losgeworden bin. Wir arbeiten da in einem Spannungsfeld von Modernität, Originalität und technischer Leistung. Das ist eine Herausforderung, der wir uns täglich stellen. Und ich liebe sie. The needs of Glycine customers have been very carefully covered through different product families. For the history of the company and the market, the most important Glycine series is the Airman family. Airman 1 was introduced in 1953 and has been continually developed. This model has found many enthusiastic buyers, primarily in the United States. The Airman 7 is the youngest member of the family. This watch with its gigantic 53 mm case keeps time in four different time zones and is equipped with three self-winding movements. Katerina Brechbühler joined the family business in 1992. She shares her father's enthusiasm and passion for watches with individual designs, large and robust cases, and straightforward functions. The Lagunare chronograph is a typical representative of the glycine philosophy with its 15 mm thick case. As is the F104, another classic glycine watch with its 52 mm diameter case. 
just a little smaller than the Airman 7. Glycine develops ideas and designs collections which are expressive, distinctive, and unmistakable. From its inspiration up until series production, a watch must go through a long and expensive creative process. This takes courage, a wealth of ideas, imagination, vision, and a large dose of idealism. Glycine, a small manufacturer making large watches for the entire world.